item 1 of the mail 224, we have uh, working with integers the point when they are talking about the profit, and this profit is written in words, and you need to write it in what? As digits. Then, how we relate ratios with fractions. That's why you see that their contributions are given as amounts, but they are saying that they obey the ratio theorem as they are contributing this amount. So, uh, when we read part A of the tasks, part A talks about, uh, it tells us to find uh, the profit that Moses needs to reinvest in the business. So what we can do, the first thing is to form a ratio. But we cannot form a ratio when we don't have a fraction. So let's do this. So we can now get a fraction. So the fraction will be 4 million by 5, 6 million. So this will give us 2 divided by 3. And the ratio now, Laura is generating ratios from fractions. So we can now see that the ratio is 2 to 3. So it means that uh, we will follow the order of the scenario. Sarah contributes two parts of the whole. Moses contributes three parts of the, of the whole. So we want to know what amount Moses needs to reinvest in the what? In the business. So we can get the total pressure, which is 2 plus 5, 2 plus 3, which is equal to 5. So we realize that. Uh, we need to, to look at the parts Moses has in relation to the total ratio. And now, what profit is made? So the profit has been stated in 